inducement device. The awesome support is a flow inducement device, and any company could be doing this. I believe that happiness is the new productivity, so we engineered the entire DNA of our company to create happiness in our employees, and people love that. Our employees do not have to wait for their vacation days to experience wonderful vacations. Make your office so much more elegant, beautiful, and peaceful than their own apartments, so they never want to leave, and, and, and they love it. Now, the other thing we did is the awesomeness report. We bring everyone together and we have our version of a company meeting. That's the hall of awesomeness. It holds about 70 people and is filled with beanbags. And the awesomeness report starts with 30 minutes of gratitude. It's fun, it's celebratory, and we give away superhero awards. We also have this tradition called mounting the puppy. So that's Eva mounting the puppy. We have a giant green puppy, and someone who does uh, really epic work gets to mount the puppy while 60 people around them shower them for three minutes with appreciation and love. Other people say it's the happiest moment of their week. We celebrate them. We acknowledge them at the awesomeness report. We send an email to the entire team celebrating them. We actually bring out the top five point earners at Mind Valley. They are the guys who lead the leaderboard. They get to stand in front, mouth the puppy, and bask for three minutes of appreciation each from 60 people hurling compliments and appreciation at them. It's beautiful to see. People have tears streaming down their eyes. And it's just something you, you, that's just really powerful to witness. And that's pretty meaningful for us. This statement is false. This statement is false. If I say to you, this statement is false, let's just think about this statement for a minute. If the statement is true, then the statement is false. And if the statement is false, then the statement is true. And we get into a loop which goes on forever. And I'd like to give you a, a simple example of this. If I say to you, this statement is false, let's just think about this statement for a minute. If the statement is true, then the statement is false. And if the statement is false, then the statement is true. And we get into a loop which goes on forever. There are always statements that can be neither proved nor disproved. If I say to you, this statement is false. If the statement is true, then the statement is false. And if the statement is false, then the statement is true. And we get into a loop which goes on forever. If I say to you, this statement is false. If the statement is true, then the statement is false. And if the statement is false, then if I say to you, this statement is false, then statement is false yeah. and if the statement is false then the statement is true and we get into a loop which goes on forever let's just think about this statement if i say to you this statement is false if the statement is true then the statement is false and if the statement is false then the statement is true and we get into a loop which goes on forever if i say to you this statement is false Thank you.
which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. And the gate into the loop, which goes on forever. 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 Thank you. Woo!